as the Emperor's spies told him, Ceri had reached Novigrad. A lone attempt to find her in the Norse's largest city would certainly fail. But Geralt had friends he could count on. The Witcher decided to contact Triss Miracle. Hello guys, welcome back to another episode of The Witcher 3. Uh, it is me, it is me, Barker Gaming. Uh, before I go any further, I just want to say massive thank you to the 700 subscriber milestone I've just achieved. Uh, absolutely phenomenal and I really do appreciate the support and the love. Um, if you are new, um, come and join the other 700 subscribers. I would really appreciate to have you on board. Um, it would be absolutely fantastic. Right, so stop giving. Um, 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 I find myself doing that quite a lot. So anyway, we are all with we are all with Tris. And if you haven't seen the previous episode, I'll put the link in top right corner. But this is where we left off. Some guys tried to kill us, and of course, it doesn't work. You can't kill a witcher. You cannot kill the witcher. You can't kill Geralt, anyway. So, we go beat this fucker up, are you? Don't kill me. Good sir, no. They forced <laughs> me. Had I not told them, they'd have set fire to my home, my warehouse. The mage hunters know no mercy. Better Spare give me some more coin. Man. Be not like those murderers. Shut up. I should kill you. Thing is, you'd be no good to anyone but the gulls as a corpse. So you'll live and pay us double. Yes. Now. Very true. Very true. F fine. Your coin. Now get. <laughs> Thanks, Geralt. Who's up behind? Somebody behind us. Uh, should watch out for yourself. There you go. You should try to keep better company. He was still better than some mages. You know, I've been thinking who might know something about Siri, And I just got an idea. There's an Oniromancer in town, Kareen Tilly. Very capable, supposedly. Never trusted in Dreamer's abilities myself. Kareen's been very effective. You should at least try. She's taken a job close by. Follow the canal, away from the fish market. The house is near the first bridge. Its owner, Dijon Kier, is a rich banker. Not coming with me? I've got some things to take care of. Another rat-infested warehouse? Not exactly. Nothing even remotely satisfying. Such are the times. Ah, oh, it's okay. Nice seeing you again. It was nice to see you again. You too, Geralt. You should go now. Before Kareen goes back into hiding somewhere. What if I want to find you? I live in the bits, near the fish market. Stop by. It'd be nice. All right. See you later. Okay. Right, where's my music gone? Um, when we were talking to that guy then, there was a guy. There was a guy standing here. I don't know if you saw him, but he was up against well, the wall. Freak. <laughs> in! You! Be gone. God, God. <laughs> he got worried then, didn't he? God, God. What's my sword anyway? God, God. <laughs> so yeah, look at my sword. Yeah. How do I how can I how can I show you my sword? How can I show the sword? No, you won't let me. Right, so we're, we've got a little lead, maybe, on Siri. But we still need money for the ride across to Skellige. Oh, I'll just see it so. There we go. Get some water. Wasn't me. That was an accident. Wasn't me.
I don't know why you won't sprint. It just won't sprint. And it's like dead close to him, the cameras. I don't know what's going on. It's a good job with you now, anyway. He says. So, we've got to go down here, I believe. I believe. I'll go. Just passing by, wanderer. Or do you seek something specific? Who's asking? Rudolf de Jonkier. Of those de Jonkiers, yes. My ancestors laid the foundations of this city. I now own its largest bank. Didn't need a recommendation. Name would have been enough. <laughs> Father always said, all ought to know your merits, son. Don't hide them under a bushel. Okay, so we're looking for Corinne. I'm looking for Corinne Tilly. Corinne. We've come to the right place, then. Corinne is inside. Been there for a few days, dreaming the home's history. Uh, the house history. Why do you care about it? Why are you still standing here, then? Oh, let me in. Let me in. I'd like to go inside, look around. I don't usually let strangers rummage around my home. Twin swords, though. You're a witcher. You may enter. Call that my whim. Thank you, good sir. Is it in case the first one breaks? Smart. <laughs> Something like that. Hello. Witch. Oh, I forgot about my loot, don't I? My loot's fallen. Please. That's blood. Don't spill it. Please. Stop. Go away. Hang on. Uh, inventory. 68 out of 60. Does my food and drink count as that? Ah, I picked up some water and I appear to not have any water on me. Okay, right, so don't loot anything else. Is she upstairs or downstairs? Upstairs. Oh, it's one of them. What's his name? What was his name? Johnny. It's a Johnny, isn't it? Well, it was. It's gone. Wake up. It's just a dream. Wake up. Okay, looks like we gotta hunt this thing. The doll. The attic. Okay. Alright. Time to check the attic. Put Loot. it down, please. That's blood. Don't spill it. Please. Don't spill it. Don't spill the blood. Alright, so. There we go. Through here. We do. Head up here. Hello, little child. Way to the next room is blocked. It's blocked, is it? This is blocked, is it? It's not blocked no more, is it? Where are you? I can hear you walking around. What's this? Drawing of a crib. Examine, examine the drawing. Rag doll. Watch good sap me now, innit? Oh no, we have got water on my inventory then, so yeah, I'm picking stuff up. So I don't need the beer, do I? I keep picking beer up, I don't really feel silver. And I pick some more beer up. And I pick some more beer up. Why is it like. I don't look. Why is it like uh, pints of log and stuff? 
Uh, so what? Examine. Oh, examine the drawing. What's the drawing? What's the story, Bellaboni? Would you like to know? This one. Paper on, on paper on which a crib has been hastily drawn by a child. It seems. Yeah. Okay. Strange stuff. A doll. Drawing shows it lying in a cradle. Maybe I should find one. Ah. Uh, okay. Loot. Piss off, ghost. If Korg was here now. Piss off, ghost. Uh, so where's Crypto? Is it in here? No, I knew. Ah. I knew he was going to do that. Well, I wonder if this is why I can't run. Ah, you know. It's just come to me. That could be why I can't run. Um, so where's the cradle? Is it downstairs? Put the doll in the crib. What crib? There's no crib. Maybe it's down here. Have you got a crib in here somewhere? After a crib. It's down here. It's here, look. Use. It's gonna tap me now, isn't it? Ah! Examine. It's what, Another man? masterpiece. An oven and a blackened grate. No oh, joy. A riddle. Guess I should find an oven. I am not. Go find an oven. Please. There's blood. Don't spill it. Please. It's going to be down here, and. Well, I would have thought it. Ooh. Open. Is it down here? Here we go. Summon. Go on, ghost. Show yourself. Boo! Fucking hell, chips off. <clears throat> Did I scare you? It's a little Johnny, isn't it? Scared you, didn't I? I can tell you were scared. Big brave man scared of wee little Sarah. Ain't that funny? I wouldn't do that anymore if I were you, Sarah. You might scare someone so bad they'll hurt you. Why would someone hurt me? Having a spot of fun's not allowed anymore. What are you playing? That lady fell asleep, and I've sent her some horrible dreams. I'll not her wake, neither. I can do that, you know. Hmm. Funny, isn't it? Very funny. Thing is, I gotta talk to the dreamer, so I'd like you to let her wake up. Little Sarah doesn't want her to wake. Little Sarah wants to play. Uh, I know what you are. You're lucky. I know you're a harmless godling, but others might not know, and then... And how'd you know I'm a godling, eh? How's that, eh? Because I know another one. If it looks like one and that's like one, trust me, you're a godling. You give the dreamer nightmares and won't let her wake up. Why are you tormenting her? I'm not tormenting anyone. Scary dreams are great. What I love is when this big end chases me. Ben's got this red. Why do you live in a haunted house? Tell you a secret. <laughs> the house ain't haunted. Not one bit. I just pretend it is. Make everyone think that. It was sitting there all empty. So I moved in. Bigwig from the bank then came and bought it. I don't like bankers. Especially not to live with. So I decided to give him a scare. Gave the banker a really big scare. See, he paid a lot for this house and won't give it up easily, which is why you need to find another home. I don't want to! I don't! I won't! Uh, 
guess I'll have to throw you out then. I can't be that harsh, can I? Right, let's make a deal. Sarah, Novigrad's no place for a godling. But if you want to live here, that's your business. So let's make a deal. A deal? What kind? Leave the dreamer alone. In exchange, I'll tell the banker the house is haunted. For good, no way to lift the curse. You tell him that? What if he doesn't believe you? I'm a witcher. He'll believe me. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. Do that and I promise not to bother your friend. Not even a little. You're awfully nice, you know. I don't hear that often. Thanks. <laughs> now go wake that sleepyhead. I won't stop her. She'll get up. Okay. Thank you, sir. Anyway, go see little Johnny in the uh, Crook Bog or wherever it's called. I'm sure you'll make good friends with really. him. Um, right, so let's go upstairs. I'm wondering this is why I can't run. Because I am full of loot. I need to sell something. Oh, she's here. Look. Wakey, wakey, sleepy head. Who are you? Triss Marigold sent me to see you. Gods. Horrible nightmares. I was supposed to dream the history of this house. Instead, I saw furniture. Hungry furniture that wished to devour me. Hmm. I know it must sound foolish. But in the dream... Well, it was all too real. And not at all amusing. The work of a godling. She made people believe the house was haunted. Also injected your dreams with her little jokes. And you managed to wake me. I feel fortunate. We witchers have our ways. I thank you very much. The dreams, they were awful. Any way I can pay you back? There is, actually. I'm looking for a young woman who was seen in Novigrad. I can certainly try to help. But I'll need to clear my head first. After those deranged dreams, I feel it's full of cobwebs. Find me at the Golden Sturgeon. I rent a room there. All right. See you there. Mm -hmm. Okay. See you there. Oh. I might have to come back here and then uh, loot everything. Well, let's go sell some swords and stuff. I need some more money, which is a, uh, a definite. Oh, for fuck's sake. I saw Miss Corrine leave, but she refused to speak to me. Is the matter resolved? Or quite the opposite. House is still haunted. Can't seem to lift the case. A bit of both. A demon had captured Kareen. I managed to free her, but the house is still haunted. Did Kareen dream of the building's past? Yeah. Pretty horrid, apparently. Though she refused to talk about it. Nobody should inhabit the place. So many crowns I paid! <laughs> oh, well. It shan't put me in the poorhouse. It's only a little white lie. <laughs> right, so we need to sell something which is over there. Where have we got to meet this woman? Is she there? Customer, no, it's customer. Ah, she's there. Okay, right, so. What about Roach? It's in the piss. Is Roach seriously taking the piss? Tell you what. Somebody's dropped me horse. Nearly here. Bless you. Ah, right, it's you. I'm gonna sell you a shitload of swords. Welcome. Welcome. Show me your wares. Looks like a Gwent's Afacondo. What? What have you got there? What have you got there? Right, I won't sell these. Which, uh, tell you what, I might sell two and keep one. Uh, that's worth nine. That's worth. Ah, oh, you're having a laugh. They're right, cheap when you go for selling. Tells you what they're worth when you look at them, and then they knock the prices right down selling them. 
three for that. Nine for that. That's worth more, so we'll sell that one. Twelve for that. Six for that. Thirty-seven for that one, look. Um, right, so... I need to sell these, don't I? I've got enough shoes and crap on me. Sell them. Sell that. Uh, hunting gauntlets. Sell that. Do I, do I sell this? Tell you what, I'm going to sell that. Too late now. We already sold it. And sell that. And sell them. Sell that. This is where. I end up naked now. I've sold everything. So long. There we go, I can I run. Guess. Yeah. Whoa, you're about to steal something on full view. Oops. Oh yeah, on full view the guard is standing right there. Oops. I didn't it was stealing, it just says loot. I thought all loot was free. Who's fighting? Gah, kick his ass. No. No. Uh where is she? She upstairs. Is she decent? Yeah, he's decent. A dream in here. Never witnessed a seance like this before, let alone participated. I will guide you. It looks like them bubbles come out of them top. Kind of top. Record. I must ask some questions. You must answer them. It's important you're truthful. Answer from your heart. Uh, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's begin. To start with, tell me a memory you have of this woman. What for? Do as I ask, please. I need the strongest, most complete memory you have of... Siri. The woman's name is Siri. Uh, I remember when we first met. I trained her at Kia Moran. Saved her life once. She was there when I died. Yeah. I accepted a job once. Did it. Asked to choose my reward, I invoked the law of surprise. Never thought I'd actually meet the child promised to me at that time. Years later, I was in the Broccolon Forest. Happened on a girl there. Didn't know who she was. The Dryads wanted to keep her, turn her into one of their own. But the Waters of Oblivion? They failed in her case. Siri came out of Broccolon with me. I sent her back to her grandmother then, but already I felt bound to her. By destiny. By something more. Thank you. Would you be willing to share another memory? Uh, the computer says no. No. Let's continue. You claim the woman has abilities. Tell me about them. Siri is a child of the Elder Blood. They call a lady of space and time. She had trouble controlling them. Let's do that one. She's a child of the Elder Blood. A descendant of Bloody Falker. The rebel burned at the stake. The prophecies claim the world's destroyer will be born of the Firebrand's cursed blood. Yeah, that one. Pure legend. <laughs> no one a legend transforms into prophecy. When it gains believers, I think you're right to be reticent in talking about the woman. I see. Do you wish to say more? Uh oh. Shall we say a little bit more? Shall we say a yeah, little bit more? Yeah. There's something else. There's something else. 
there's always something else. Let's move on. <laughs> Um, she have control, I trouble controlling Siri having trouble controlling her abilities. Yennefer tried to teach her to cast simple spells, and Siri destroyed a shed near the temple where they were. Really upset her, but it was just an old shed. I know it took her a while to gain control, and frankly, I doubt she controls her abilities fully to this day. I see. Do you wish to say more? No, I said no. Computer says no. No. Can we start? Natural. I knew you cared about her. But your tone, the emotions you so carefully conceal. Let's continue, please. Make yourself comfortable and try to relax. You must yes, ma'am. And talk of Siri. Tell me where you think she might be. Who could be at her side? Mm -hmm. If Siri couldn't find me, I'm sure she would have looked for another friend. Who do you mean? Uh, Yennefer or Triss? Yennefer wasn't in Novigrad. Triss was. But Siri never found her. Maybe Dandelion? They liked each other a lot. Why well, have I got light on? Oh, is this uh, Yasuke? Looks like it. Being stalked by a bird. The dreams can multiply. Show the past as well as the future. The swallow. It symbolizes Siri. She contacted Dandelion. I didn't know he was in town. The poet. Heard about him. Someone left him the rosemary and thyme in their will. Uh, the rosemary and thyme. That and then. The rosemary and thyme. Where's that? As you enter the city through the red light district, you come upon a bridge. The Rosemary is just past it. Dandelion inherited a brothel? So I've heard. Okay. Thanks for your help. Good luck, Witcher. I hope you find your Siri. Uh, why are you standing on the chair? <laughs> yes. Yes. Are you standing on that chair? Yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> Mug. How many bloody mugs have I got? I've already got a shitload of mugs. And empty bottles. And vials. Never enough watered up. Ah, right, you cannot do it. Oh, I keep pressing the right thumbstick. I've just pressed it again. Um. Yeah, so I thought that was Yasuke, but apparently it's not, it's Dandelion. Maybe Dandelion is Yasuke. I'm not 100% sure. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> well, let's go! We're building the money up anyway, so we're now on 411. Another 600 to go. Then we can go to Skellige. Or Skelly. <laughs> Why have I got fight bandits? I don't want fighter bandits. Why some bandits in this city? Go on, get up. Just keep going. Keep going. Go on. There we go. 
We don't have to fight if we don't want to. Got my eye on you. Hey, got my eye on you, my friend. We take the bread. Boom, bread. No, I don't know what this dwarf and dwarf and cuts for. Oh, I need a rest. Do you? Also, say the gods have heard the lands cry as people long way to Zuba, King Radovid, will save the north. Good for him. Locked. How do we get in? Was there another door? Might be another door. Beggar. I'll never come back, you stinking. Here we go. <laughs> Next time I'll rip your fucking legs off and shove them up your ass till you've toes for teeth. <laughs> In the nick of time, as always. <laughs> Zoltan, with your boot to someone's ass, as always. Who were those men? Local color. I wasn't they gone more than a moment. Long enough for them to turn our home into theirs. <laughs> All right, time for some spring cleaning. Have oh, here we go. Out. Care to join me? With pleasure. Into his soul. Mistake. Boom! Almost KO'd that one. Ready? There we go. Has it just got back up? Whoa, what happened then? I'm stuck. Can't see. Don't know what I'm doing. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. What is that? Yeah, almost like we never left her. Oh, I drank beer. How long are you gonna make me wait? Get up him. KO. Boom. That's it, isn't it? Punch him again before he runs off. Ah, please. That went well. Now we can greet each other like the gods of the ages. Hey, Sultan. You look good. Training plenty lately. What with the war on, no Mahakaman meat to be found, but Redanian laggers standing in just fine. You, though, you've withered a bit. Something worrying you. It's about Siri. I know she came to Novigrad. Might still be here. You mean she's come back? I'll be damned. I wonder if I'd recognize her. How many years is it now? Six? Seven? But what'd she be doing here? Hiding, probably. She might be in danger. See her in your dreams? Couple times. Her and the Wild Hunt. Oh, not good. No, not, not all, good. But I know she came here and contacted Dandelion. <sighs> we have a wee problem then. Where's Dandelion? Where's Dandelion? <laughs> I'd like to know that myself. Maybe he could explain what the hell's going on. I just barely returned, as you saw. I'm expecting to come home to your heart like a boar in some cold ale. What do you find instead? A shite storm. Hmm. Dandelion gone, the tavern chock full of bums. Have no clue what happened. Hmm. Let's look around. Might find something that'll put us on his trail. Prime idea. I say we start on the ground floor. It's where he sat and wrote. Uh, I did see something in the window. Yeah. Hmm. Ten barrels of Tucson dry. Five cases of sodden triple mead. Hmm. Nothing here. No, 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 no. That's exactly what we're looking for. It says planner. That's rich. Dandelion and planning. Starting to look like a man's use about his business. 
So look at all. Seems Dandelion's taking the tavern business seriously. If you only knew. Gives it everything. No seen him this obsessed ever. Seems when he inherited this fine establishment, it came with some fine responsibilities. Bookkeeping among them. He also made a habit of noting down the times of his meetings, official and private. So, who'd he been seeing of late? Ah, here it is. Oh. Hmm. Seems he's only been meeting women of late. The dog. The dog. Uh, not interested in his romantic outings. That could help. That could help, couldn't it? Because we should know one of them women. Or find him, hmm. at least. Not a bad idea. Dandelion's pretty loose-lipped. Might have blabbed something to a lady friend that'll put us on his trail. That's what I'm counting on. Hmm. We should divide these somehow. Perhaps... Ah, fuck it. <laughs> I'll ask the lassies in my half, you interrogate the ones in yours. Should you? Yay. Zoltan, wait. This is in verse. And you figure that's unnatural because... Wonderful. Meet me back here when you're done. Share our findings. Right you are. Need to do a wee bit of tidying for a go. Cannot stomach the idea of coming back to this mess. And you'd be wise to read your bit before you scurry off. If you need anything, I'll be next door. Okay. Right, so I think we're going on a hunt for a list of women to find Dandelion. So, I think I'll leave this episode here and we shall go and continue that next episode. Uh, thanks for watching. If you've enjoyed this episode, don't forget to smash that like button. Smash the subscribe button. We are over 700 subscribers, just to remind you again. So happy about it. So, yeah, thank you for that. Um, so, yeah, have a good day, have a good week, whatever you are doing, and I shall see you all on the next episode. Thanks, guys.